Kelly, right here on Local 10, actress Ashley Judd, speaking about an, in an exclusive with ABC News about her mother. Yeah, this is the first time she's revealing how her mother, Naomi Judge, took her own life. Local 10 News reporter Alexis Frazier is in the newsroom with the details. Yeah, she wanted to speak on behalf of the entire Judd family to talk about her mother's life and not just the struggle, but also the joy. years, the Judds have spoken publicly about their challenging family life with a mother who was wounded by trauma and depression, but filled with dreams and drive. Mom was a brilliant conversationalist. She was a star. She was an underrated songwriter. And she was someone who suffered from mental illness. In the hills of Tennessee, the Judds have lived in separate houses, but minutes apart. Ashley Judd's grief shared by her sister and her stepfather, who they call Pop. Ashley sharing her mother's story weeks after her death. Mother used a firearm. So that's the piece of information that we are very uncomfortable sharing, but understand that we're in a position that, uh, you know, if we don't say it, someone else is, is going to. Ashley said she was with her mom minutes before she took her life and was the person who found her. I went upstairs to let her know that the friend was there and I discovered her. I have both grief and trauma from, um, from discovering her. Ashley saying her mother at times would become distant. She was very isolated in many ways because of the disease. And yet there were a lot of people who showed up for her over the years, not just me including her sister Winona, who sent a letter to share with us. I laugh and I cry and I thank God we have each other. I need to take some time to process and I need this time to myself. I'm not ready yet to speak publicly about what happened. Love can feel the Don't you think it's time? Well, that performance you just saw was at the 2022 CMT Awards that happened last month when Naomi and Wyona joined their voices one final time. In the newsroom, Alexis Frazier, Local 10 News.